hello biggest baby family i'm glad to have you guys on here today and yeah we're winding down the year with a big news from emmanuel yes emmanuel omar jr has hit it big this time yeah he has been featured on the cover page like on the front page of man magazine and for any celebrity this is a big deal yeah mag man magazine is quite is very popular in west africa and especially in nigeria and I, he's the first people that Nigeria house me to feature in this magazine. I mean, this is such a beautiful way to, you know, round up the year. Emmanuel has had such an eventful year. And I want to announce to you that there are still very big announcements coming. Don't forget, 2021 is not yet over. But for Emmanuel, there are several huge announcements that will be made to the public before the end of 2021. At least three of them, which I'm privy to. Yeah, Emmanuel has had such an eventful career. It's really amazing. Yeah, Emmanuel was a model before he got into the Big Brother Niger house. Actually, he was Mr. Africa, but you know, he wasn't really popular. But getting into the house, the first few weeks, no one knew about him. Then coming up with his relationship with Nico Rose, he was, it blew his career big time. He grew a fan base called the Emirates. Then the Emirates shippers and all of that. These guys have been his support system. And I'm very glad with the way he handles them. This guy knows that he owes them a lot. Hence, he's always appreciative to them. And he also thanks God for, you know, the platform called Big Brother Niger. Yeah, Emmanuel is not the only, you know, housemate that got into the Big Brother Niger house. But it's clear that this guy has leveraged so much upon it. And yeah, his, his friendship with Nicoros has really rubbed off positively on him. I mean, every publicity that comes to her some way find shines his race too on him and he too he's doing perfectly well so guys don't get me wrong emmanuel is not you know growing under her shadows or something no he's not hiding under her shadows rather both of them are doing individually well and then doing perfect as a couple and the guy has really blossomed from that young man who was not so sure of himself yeah he said that to biggie a couple of times during the diary sessions i mean he was he actually said that he felt intimidated when he was in the house you know good looking guys that were as tall as he was that had already achieved so much in life and all of that then being one of the youngest housemates emmanuel has grown has blossomed to be that mature guy that guy who is so sure of himself who handles issues perfectly who knows how to give the best interviews i mean intellectual answers emmanuel is really a good and a great guy yeah man i see this guy really doing so well in 2022 and yeah he's he has started begun his foray into the nigerian movie industry yeah with cinema movies two of them which you soon hear about emmanuel is set to do big things one very striking thing emmanuel did was to you know Stay signed on to the kind of management he has. For Likoros, Likoros has play management, but Emmanuel's management is hardly known. But these guys keep working, you know, behind the scene to keep this guy, you know, in touch with good deals and all of that. And these guys are amazing. The strength of every act, of every talent, of every, you know, celebrity is his or her management. And Emmanuel's management have really done well for him. This guy has, you know, clinched some super, you know, in, in endorsement deals and all of that all because of his solid management this is still biggie's baby tv and please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and yeah fam we've just hit the 2000 mark if you're still on the journey to you know 10,000 subscribers and like fam i urge you to do you know jump in on this and help us support us with one like just one like from me is all we need you know to grow and keep growing thank you so much for all the love and support and god bless you fam please do enjoy your holidays Peace out, fam.